Hello my fans and welcome to Marlboro Dealer Traits. Today we are building this Kansas City Southern number 4006 the Veterans Unit. And this is the SC70 ACE. As you can tell, the Veterans Unit looks like an American flag like this. With the, because the reason why I just put perch buttons right here because that's the stars of our American flag like this. So anyways, so let's get right into the build now. For the first step, they take out black concrete to start off. And then let's take roll black concrete. We want to make that two by three. And then let's take roll of polished black stone brick stairs at the bottom corner. And we want to make this middle section that is 35 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Do the same thing for the front, for the back. And then let's do the other side here. And polished by stone brick stairs. <clears throat> now let's take a row of black concrete to make a secondary, a secondary wall here. Plus, which stone slabs to be the stairwell. Like that. Take the other side. And then go to the other side, do the exact same thing. Now let's roll here, and then another one like that. And then take a roll of black concrete of each side. Now let's take three blocks wide using roll of black concrete. Once you got that, let's go to the front. So let's grab a roll of, so let's grab a, a polished black stone brick slab with a coupler and want to attach that down. A sideways dark oak fence gate. Do the next thing on the side. And get another roll of polished black stone brick st stair series. With a coupler, want to attach that down and sideways dark oak fence gate. And then let's take a roll of trick bar hook for the air brakes. And then let's take a roll like that. Just like that. Then let's grab some fences. So let's grab so let's grab birch fence and another brick fence. So let's grab birch fences and another brick fences. Let's take another one like that. Now let's take a roll of, so let's grab a roll of, so let's grab a little item frame here, with this light, just like that, for the back row is going to be regular item frames. Now let's grab some wheels, so let's grab hoppers. So let's grab hoppers here, so let's grab roll hoppers. And then let's take stone brick slab to the axle here. And then let's do that. So let's grab two rows of hoppers for the eight, three axles here. And let's take stone brick slabs all the way across here. And then go to the other side, do the exact same thing in this row here.
And then let's take a row of stone um, slabs here. And then let's take black concrete to be the fuel tank all across here. And the other side, just like that. Then let's grab a roll black concrete all the way across it here. And then let's take a roll like that. Now let's take a roll of. So let's grab a roll of polished black stone brick stairs. Be this side of the fuel tank. So let's grab one of them across here. And then the other side. And let's take two rolls of black concrete and one black concrete on this side. <clears throat> and let's take three here and then three, another one like that. And let's take four here and then slide up top like this. And then this one's going to be full of black concrete all the way across like this. Now let's take a roll of, oh, so let's grab a roll of smooth quartz slab here. Only across here and then the other side and let's wrap all the way across like that. Okay, one, two, like that, and let's do the other side for the front. Now let's take a roll of blue concrete to make the cap so let's grab blue concrete red concrete white concrete we want to have birch button and we also need some windows so let's grab black stained glass so let's grab black stained glass block um black white stained glass block um black stained glass pane iron bars and some and they will also be Move quartz stairs, but we're going to use a row of warp stairs. Okay, so let's get started. So let's grab roll blue concrete. This one's going to be full of blue concrete, and then warp it, warp stairs. And then let's take, let's take a little outer frame up top like that from the nose of our cap here, and let's take a roll of birch button right here for the stars of our American flag, our Kansas City Southern, number 4006, Veterans Unit. And let's take a roll of blue concrete. And then the other side, we want to connect it more using a roll of blue concrete. Let's take two here, and then we want to destroy those three here. that now we want to replace it into bedrock so let's grab so let's grab bedrocks some blue concrete and let's take a roll roll blue concrete here and then another, another roll blue concrete and then bedrock and take another roll use a roll of blue concrete here and then take another roll use a roll blue concrete just like this and then one up top, and then another one, back row, but we're going to destroy those right here, so now one's supposed to be this side, because I just did it backwards, but <laughs> anyways, so let's grab a row of blue concrete here, until we stop right there on this last session that we just placed polish box stone with stairs on that side so anyway so let's grab a roll of blue here so let's grab another roll of blue here and then let's take black stained glass box on top right here and then blue concrete then another one and then let's take a roll of 
So let's grab roll of warp stairs. So let's grab roll of warp it here. So let's grab black stained glass pane. So let's grab warp stairs here. And then let's take a roll of blue concrete up top like this. And then let's take another roll. Choosing roll of blue concrete here. We want to have two. So we want to have two here and one here. And then let's take a roll of bedrock again. So let's grab bedrock. So let's grab three here. And the other side. But it's different than the other SD7 ECEs. But the bedrocks are here. Normally it was two on this side. But now it's three on this side right here. Because it's much, much more different than the other SD7 ECEs. My previous ones. But we're going to use a roll more rolls of blue concrete and then let's take a roll of red rock here so let's grab another roll of blue concrete like this so this is for the stars of our american flag of our Kansas city southern number 406 then insurance so let's grab another roll using roll of using roll some first buttons here for the stars of our american flag just like this we want to grab all around the, the front of the cab just like this and we're going to use a roll of iron bars at each side and we want to also go do the exact same thing just like with the other side and then we want to connect it all around the cab. and then let's take another roll moving roll of birch buttons on each side like this perfect now let's grab a roll of warp sign so let's grab warp sign here so let's grab so, so let's grab 406 and 406 and then let's take a roll of glow ink sack so let's grab a glow ink sack to light it up so let's grab a little light this this one up. When it glows dark at night time over here, it should pop up like that. So that's 406. Just like this. Anyway, so let's make our stripe of our American flag. So, so now let's go over here and let's grab red concrete on the bottom row here. And until we stop right there, because that, that side is going to be green in the back row. And this is the part of our Kansas City Southern number 406 veterans unit of each side. Whoa, 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 not the blue concrete. That's a little mistake right here. I thought that was going to look like that. But we're going to use a roll of stripes using a roll of red concrete of each side. And then let's take a roll of white concrete all the way across it here. Except one right here. Because let's grab another roll of red concrete. We want to have by seven. So let's grab one, two, three four five six seven seven here and then let's go to the other side do the exact same thing on the row of each side over here using row of red concrete to make the stripes of our tennis in the number 406 veterans of each side of our locomotive up her of our xc 7 ate because normally norfolk sun does have veterans you over here number two, number um 6920 and then they've equipped it that horn right here for we normally it has a rs r35t horn on that right here on oh, my previous ones are here that i never never seen before over here because because i normally like caught north of southern but we're going to use a roll of mangrove slab right here and then let's take a roll of let's grab mangrove slab here and then let's take another roll like that. And then let's take a roll of dark of landscape for the horn like this. And then let's go to the bottom. And then let's take a roll of Paul's Blackstone with stairs. So let's grab by seven. So let's grab one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, like that. Then let's go to the other side, do the exact same thing right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven just like that 
Now let's go up top right here and let's take some smooth quartz slabs right here. So let's grab two here and then two here. Of each side like that. But the back row, we're gonna use a row of lime green concrete. So let's grab one, two, three. Make that U shape right here and want to connect it all the way around here using roll of fine green concrete up each side. And then the other one this and then let's go to the pack right here. So then we just so that anyway. So now let's go over here and let's grab some so let's grab a roll of birch let's get so let's grab Make the first fence gates right here, open up right here. This is for the headlights here. And then let's take a row of warp sign again. So this for the back row. So let's grab 4006. And then 4006. And then light it up using row of glow ink sand. Just like that. And let's take a roll of white stone gun plug for the back row like this. And then the white stone glass block in front of it also as well. Just like that. And then another headlight or the ditch lights right here for another headlight using roll of for head seats. Things like that. Like that. Okay, one, two, got that. Now let's get started making the banners right here. Okay, we need to get started making. So let's grab row banners right here. Okay, um, so let's grab. Okay, we need black banner, and then let's grab row of. So let's grab row of. So let's grab row of blue. Let's grab lapis lazuli, and then black dye right here. So okay, we need black banner. And let's grab that with Zooey. Grab a new banner and place the border and then place bottom middle like that. Okay, once you got that, so let's grab one in the back right there and one on the left. But I might destroy here so I can have room right here for each side. Right, once you got that, and I'm going to destroy right here. But I'm going to use a roll of fences. So let's grab a knee. A knee right here at fence. All the way across right here. And then let's take another row here. And we want to connect it all the way across. So let's go another big fence here. And then let's grab another, another fence right here. And take another one like that, and we want to connect it all the way across just like this, and then take another one like that. All right, so now let's grab a row of so let's grab a row of warp it um, stairs here, and then let's take a row of string. So let's grab a spider string. So cover until we carpet up our up our Kansas City Sutter number 406 Grand Rose unit of our SD Sutter ACE like that. And then let's go to the other side all the way across just like this. Let's so stop right here. Just like this. And for the final row, so let's grab so, so let's grab roll of So let's and for the final row, so let's grab white carpet. So so let's grab white carpet right here, all the way around. So let's grab all the way. So let's grab all the all the way around, whole surface using white carpet, and that's the left side of our Kennedy server number 406 veterans unit to make a walkthrough of our AC7 SD7 ACE all the way across, just like that. And all the way above, like 
this and that's where we place it there and there and that's where we have it right here perfect all right so that is pretty much it on how to build this kansas city southern number 406 veterans unit sd7 ace i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have it make sure to hit the like button below and subscribe on wild world daily trends on youtube stop and posting more videos in the future and i will see you guys next time so bye